Hello everyone and welcome to another bike review video here on the channel. Binyam Gemai has been one of the revelations of 2022 for the cycling world. The Airtrain superstar grabbed headlines when he won Gent Webelgem and a stage in the Giro d'Italia to put it in short. However, the cycling world first sat up truly when the young star finished second in the under 23 road race at the World Championships in Flanders last year. But in today's video, we're gonna take a closer look at the bike that he will be using at the 2022 World Championships road race, this time in the elite category. But before we take a closer look at his bike, please subscribe to the Cycling Day Extra channel to help us make our way towards the 10,000 subscribers and check out the preview for the road race over on the Cycling Dane. So, Binyam Gemai will defend the colors of his nation of Eritrea at the World Championships with a custom cube Lightning C68X, which is embracing his Eritrea nation in its livery. Cube have said that this Lightning C68X has been its most intensive bike development to date and the bike is of course equipped with the Shimano Dura Race group set. This bike reportedly took 1000 hours of computer modeling and over 100 hours of wind tunnel testing to enhance the aerodynamics of the bike overall which has led to this very unique frame design. The frame is a lightweight carbon chassis using the Lightning C68X Monoka advanced twin mold technology with a frame weight of 799 grams for a 54 centimeter frame. However, Binyam Gumai will be riding a 56 centimeter frame, so this could be a bit more. Cube boasts that this frame has a significant 30% reduction in drag relative to its 2015 design, meaning a saving of 30 watts. The frame is of course UCI compliant and it elegantly integrates the fork stem, handlebar and seat post. The cockpit is the ICR Aero cockpit system with integrated cable routing as per market trend. The wheels are the advanced SLR65 weighing in at 1574 grams and the stream rims are made from the highest quality UD carbon fibers. The wheels were designed with omnidirectional wind conditions in mind and therefore the profile is neutral in crosswinds. The inner width of the wheels are 18 millimeters and have been optimized for tires with a width of 25 to 28 millimeters. Staying on the wheels, it incorporates the light slim Newman fade hubs which reduce air turbulence and ensure even less air resistance in the wheel. The 21 hole front wheel hub for 2 to 1 spoking is a new development especially for stream wheels. Equally the stream wheels are built with pillar wing aero spokes, only 21 spokes on the front wheel to reduce the rotational drag. And these wheels are equipped with the fast but robust Continental Grand Prix 5000 S. TR tires, which of course are tubeless and compatible with hookless rims, weighing in at 180 grams, which is incidentally 20 grams lighter than the Pirelli P0 race TLR tires. This bike is truly built for speed and is definitely right for the terrain that Wolonga will throw at Binyam Gumai. So it'll be very interesting to see if Binyam Gumai can actually get another medal in the World Championships and potentially this time he could even win the rainbow jersey. That's basically it for this video. Make sure to check out the Matteo Trentin video of his bike review and comment down below what you thought of this beautiful looking bike and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and of course as always thank you for watching and have a nice day